Johnson and Attorney King, could you please stand? Please give this family some love in Atlanta. Give this family some love. I come to you by way of, I'm not a pastor. I'm not an elected official. I got no hidden agendas. Everybody's been talking about our beloved Governor Nathan Deal, correct? Yes. Well, raise your hand if you saw the program this morning. Raise your hand if you saw the program at Ebenezer. Raise your hand if you saw our beloved governor sit there for 30 minutes for a photo op and then leave out of Dr. King's church. Raise your hand for a governor that's going to sit and soak in the spirit of Dr. King but not practice his teachings. Here's a message to Governor Deal. Go ahead. Since you're so filled with the King, with the spirit of Dr. King, there's two things that you can do. One of them has been said over and over again. Sign your name on the dotted line to extend Medicaid. Start right there, number one. Yeah, go ahead. And number two, order the coroner's inquest yeah. for this Johnson family yeah. so they can find out what has happened to their child. That's right. That's right. Oh, make no mistake about it. He's the chief officer here in Georgia. That's right. If you don't want race to play a part in it, I'm winking. If you don't want race to play a part in it, how about for the corruption of the different agencies that are supposed to uphold the law right here in the state of Georgia? They lock us up on a day to day basis when we break the law, disrespect the law. Sometimes when we're not even, well, sometimes when we're abiding by the law. Clean up your state, Governor. Go ahead, Martha. For the Johnson family. Raise your hand again if you've seen the news reports saying that it's not illegal to stuff a body full of newspaper. Have you seen that? Well, Attorney King, you hit the nail on the head. They love to do this diversion. I want to tell them, fool, we're not talking about the newspaper. We're talking about who ordered the removal of the organs and who removed them. son and the mystery has not been solved and yet they dug him up and his body was empty and they want to talk about whether it was legal or illegal for the newspaper I promise you this get ready Atlanta get ready Valdosta for two mass rallies at the federal level sending a message to Michael Moore the prosecutor who's leading the investigation that we are upset and To my brothers and my sisters of the younger generation. Man, stop the violence, man. Go ahead, Marcus. Stop the violence, man. Hey, listen, I get pissed off more than y'all. I know. I want to do things to people. I'm not going to tell a lie. I know. But you're dwindling the numbers, and I rub elbows with these people I'm getting ready to talk about. These people who sit high and look low, they get nervous every time I touch the mic because they don't know if I'm going to let out a secret that's in that smoke-filled room. But they are loving the fact 